So, shall we begin? There are some tasks that I'm unequipped to handle my... Excellent. As you've hopefully been made aware by now, the source of the weather phenomenon outside is a device that is under our control. Or rather, the lack thereof. Control, that is. In order to solve this error, we'll need to acquire the weather machine's blueprints. They are in the wall safe just over there. If only it were that simple. The safe can only be opened with a key. A key that my beloved wife Cassie has chosen to hide in a... ...so secure that only she knows where it is. This is... ...problematic, as she has been unwell and unresponsive for quite some time. That said, she is... ...was... ...a diligent notekeeper. I'm certain you could find out where she moved the key to if you were to search through her notes. You should find them all in our room upstairs. It is unlocked, so you should be able to just walk in. With my condition as it is, I'm unable to do this myself. I dare say I barely understand it myself. Since, alas, written text, paper, and terminal... Discussing the boring details any further, Alpha. You will? Oh, best of luck. These jumpsuits don't leave much room for expression. Science and discoveries and news. Screw it. I miss how it was before. I mean, there were other vaults than ours. Are you really that surprised? It's a shame we don't have the work. Force to spruce this place up a little. Vault 63 has lasted this long. No reason to think it won't keep lasting. I'm really gonna miss Alfie. people are using out there. What if we go 
back to the surface and nobody wants to know us because of our, you know, condition. Stockpile from the supply runs. Seeing someone do so much good around here. What the hell are you doing in here? Get your filthy hands off her! What's that? Oh. I understand. I apologize. Truly. I am just very protective of... Of course she has the key herself. I should have known. Yes. Very well. If you would excuse me, I would like a moment with my wife. Come find me when you have the blueprints. I could use some help over here. <clears throat> yes. soon. What if we go back to the surface? Nobody wants to know us because of that. This research and science and discoveries. Vault 63 has lasted this long. I think it won't keep. 
could I believe you have something for me. Well, they're not good to me. I can go deliver them to my daughter, Audrey. She's the one who's leading the effort. Oh, and before I forget, um, our conversation earlier. In Cassie's room. Water under the bridge, yes? I do hope we can keep that just between us. I'd hate for rumors to flutter about. I'm happy to hear it. Oh, and before you go off to Audrey, I would like you to indulge me in another thought exercise I've been meditating on. If you were to repair a ship by replacing it plank by plank, piece by piece, so much so that no single piece of wood, or would it still be the original? <laughs> right you are, my friend. Let's say for this example that we can agree that eventually it is a new ship. Because I think the more interesting question is, at what point does it become so? After half of the planks? After the final part is replaced? Perhaps the rudder? Or mast? If we were to change piece by piece, at what point do we become something entirely new? Up. Huh? One moment. Let's perhaps hold on an answer. I'd rather that linger with you a bit. And you have important business to attend to. She's buried in her books in the meteorology sector. I hope... Community gathering around here. You there! I don't know you. Why are you in my lab? What's this? Oh, the blueprints! Fantastic! Did my father send you? Are we hiring outside help for the mailroom now? Never mind that. It doesn't matter. All that matters is that I finally have these.
Yes, yes. Very excellent parcel delivery. Off with you, then. Actually, wait a moment. A helpful minion could be quite useful. Could you give me two seconds to read this? Here's a little reward for you. Count your bottle caps while I go over these blueprints. Come back when you're ready for more work. <laughs>